Welcome to this Municipality GIS demonstration. I'm Linda Rockwood, owner of Mohawk Valley GIS in Herkimer, New York. I'm going to be using a desktop GIS software package from Manifold Systems that costs $245. We're going to start out looking at some data for the village of Oriskany Falls. I've already loaded in hydrants, parcels, streets, water lines, and a background aerial photo from 2008. Let's go ahead and create a map that combines all this data together. We'll open it up and let's maximize the display. And if I zoom in here, you can get a little better sense of what we're looking at. I can turn the aerial photo on and off. You can see the tax parcel outlines in green. Streets are in black, water lines in blue, hydrants. Certainly we can search for data. Uh, let's search for a tax parcel. We could do it by tax ID. I don't happen to know that. Let's do a search by owner name instead. I know the person's last name. I can do a starting with query and I'll do Ames. I don't know the first name. I'm not sure if it's the husband or wife maybe that owns the property. And I'll do a search and let's zoom in here. The result was highlighted here in the blue. And you can set that to be any color you want, by the way. If I right click and I pick fields, now I see all the real property data associated. It turns out it's Christine Ames. And here's uh, the tax ID, here's property class, single family, uh, land assessed, total assessed value, and so on. So we'll close that out. All right, let's pretend that we want to extend our water line and add another hydrant. I'm going to come over here to the edge of the village. And any time that you work with data, um, you need to be sure that you have snapping turned on. This way you don't leave any gaps when you're creating or editing data. I'm going to insert a line. And we're going to extend the water line here. And we'll just kind of come down along the property line in the street. And so there's my extended line. And let's just grab a, a little bit more here to put the hydrant so we'll go there. And then I'm going to switch to hydrants. And I'm going to add a point. And again, with snapping on, I'm going to put that point right there. So now I know no matter how far I zoom in, I've got that hydrant. And I screwed up there on the digitizing of the water line. I would do an edit and come back and delete that teeny little piece where I messed up. Um, but no harm done. All right, let's say one of the neat things with the Manifold GIS software is that you can read in Excel spreadsheets. And you can also save your data back out as Excel spreadsheets. So for instance, let's say your highway department is tracking their paving history with an Excel spreadsheet and you've got street names, dates, the type of work. You read in that spreadsheet, you link it to the streets data layer, and then you display. And here we have uh, City of Johnstown paving history color-coded by year. What other things might you do with a desktop GIS? Well, you can certainly measure distances and areas like rooftops. You can find things within distances of other things. You can find all the butters to a property and export the results to an Excel spreadsheet and then create mailing labels in Word uh, at no extra cost. I mean, that's all built right in. Um, you can find all parcels within 300 feet of a stream. Let's say you need to change the drainage in part of town. You can do a watershed analysis. Or maybe you're dealing with a proposed wind farm coming to town. You can do a viewshed analysis that lets you determine what can be seen from where. You can track crime patterns over time. You can use GIS to help with economic development efforts. What's important to remember is GIS is a tool, just like a spreadsheet is a tool. It works with data that has a location, and about 80% of the data we work with has location. So to learn more about desktop GIS, to ask any questions, to schedule a visit, please feel free to contact me, Linda Rockwood, at 315-866-2746 or email lrockwu at twcny.rr.com. Thanks for your interest. Have a great day.